Why study modes? For me, there are several clear reasons. The first is most of the music of the world can be looked at through the six main modes that we work with in this course. That's the first reason. The second reason is with the six, these same six modes, we get access to every one of the chromatic pitches. So every pitch is, uh, no pitch is left out. These, these six modes cover all 12 of the chromatic pitches, which is what we want to learn. We want to learn the sound of all of these pitches within the different modal contexts. Looking at music through these modes is, it's just awesome. It gives you a, a much broader sense of all the colors available to you as a musician, as opposed to focusing on the major and minor scales, which is how traditional music is done, traditional Western music, I should say. So what we do is we bring in the all the other modal flavors all at the same time and we start working with the sounds and the, the the critical thing is to learn the sound first and and then apply the theory later if you want to not necessary if you just learn the sound so we'll be working with um you know what does the what does the flat seventh what does the tay sound like over uh, uh, uh in a dorian mode what does it sound like in aeolian what does it sound like in Mixolydian. What does it sound like in the Lydian? It's not in the Lydian, but still that's a sound that's that's available to us. If you don't know any of these terms, don't worry about that. We go into it um, at the appropriate moment as we build up these structures. The third reason is even when you go into the exotic modes and extended modes of which a lot of music comes from, those still are combinations of our six main modes. So the first few notes of this mode, the middle notes of this mode, and the upper notes of this mode. So if you work with these six modes, you've, you're getting access to all, all the world's music. And finally, this approach in this course gives you access to music that's not traditionally modal music. So I'm, I'm using the approach to to study and, and learn and look at and memorize and explore uh, the music of Bach, John Coltrane, even the 20th century composer Messian. It all works with this approach, even though they're not technically what we call modal music. It's still the 12 notes. We've learned the 12 notes with a, a, a center note and now you can go and explore. So if you're interested in this, and this is an exploration, this is not a download of information. I'm not going to give you any information that you can't find elsewhere, but what I've done is I put together a context where you can experience all these tones and take an internal impression of them, an impression that goes with your values, your musical values, how you hear music that fits with the music that you know and love, and then you explore from that. So I've made a context where you can learn the sounds and then uh, there's a f the framework allows you to expand out and explore. If that's interesting to you, please come join the course. It begins on October 12th. It runs for nine weeks straight. And if you want to join in, I'd love to have you and I would be very much looking forward to working with you.